Hi, this is Kelly with American Hydroponics. I'm gonna show you a few tips for plumbing your solenoid. So when you purchase a solenoid and you need to mount it for your pH mini doser or your IntelliDose, this is what you'll receive. Your hardware and your adapter. The solenoid pre-wired and your solenoid tubing. So the solenoid is easily mounted to the wall. There are two holes here on each side of the solenoid where this will mount to any surface. We usually recommend that you put it on a small piece of wood to keep it sturdy. It comes with two screws and two drywall anchors. It also comes with a small adapter. When you're looking at the solenoid, here from the side angle you can see the front of the solenoid is the fill. So you will connect this via tubing, 3 8 inch tube, to the tank of your nutrient solution that will be mounted above it. This on the bottom is the output. So this is going to connect to your 3 8 to quarter inch adapter that comes with a solenoid to your quarter inch tubing. And this tube will go into your reservoir. This release valve is of no use to us, so don't worry about it. This adapter can be pretty tight to get on. We do recommend using a bit of soapy water, warm soapy water, to make it a little bit easier. And you just dip this in. So once you dip it in the warm soapy water, then you can attach it to the bottom of the solenoid. Now this can be a tight fit, so you have to work it in. But once you get it on, it'll form a nice tight seal and you won't have any leaks. And then from the bottom of the adapter, you attach the quarter inch tubing. This tubing will then go into your reservoir so that it'll dose your nutrients and your additives and your pH solution directly into your res. We get a lot of questions on the proper mounting placement of our solenoids. Here's a tip. This is a four part solenoid board and this is one of your dosing options with the IntelliDose. And that's how easy it is. From all of us here at American Hydroponics, happy growing.